In this video, we're going to show you how to install a CPU water block on the AMD Socket AM4 motherboard. First, prepare the AMD Socket mounting plate. Place the CPU water block on an even surface and remove four M4 by 12 screws, attaching the aluminum base to the top using a 2.5 mm Allen key in counterclockwise direction. Replace the Intel factory installed mounting plate with an AMD one. You will feel the mounting plate locking into the position when placed correctly onto the top. Reset the O-ring gasket into the gap between the mounting plate and the water block top. Be careful that the orientation of the aluminum base is as shown. Reinstall the M4 by 12 screws and tighten them using the 2.5 mm Allen key to screw them in a clockwise direction. If already installed, please remove the motherboard from your computer and place it on an even surface with the front facing up. Using a Phillips head screwdriver, remove the four UNC screws securing the original plastic hold down clamps around the socket as shown here. Rotate the motherboard and remove the original AMD backplate and the hold down clamps and store them away. With the motherboard rotated, install the rubber gasket and metal backplate for the AMD AM4 socket to the back of the motherboard rib side up. Align the holes on the motherboard with holes on rubber gasket and backplate. Carefully rotate motherboard assembly with front side facing up with one hand while holding the backplate and rubber in place with the other hand. Install four M4 thumb screws onto your motherboard. It is mandatory to put a 0.7 mm plastic washer underneath each of the M4 thumb screws. Tighten the screws to the metal backplate until you reach the end of the thread. Using tools such as pliers is not recommended. If you had other CPU cooling solution before, you have to wipe the CPU's contact surface by using non-abrasive cloth or Q-tip. Take the enclosed thermal compound and apply it to the CPU heat spreader. The quantity of about two rice grains is just about right. There is no need to cover the whole IHS. Applying too much thermal grease will have a negative impact on the cooling performance. Take the CPU water block and remove the sticker on the aluminum head. Align the water block over the mounting screws on the motherboard and CPU. Place an enclosed compression spring and thumb nut over each M4 thumb screw. Start fastening two thumb nuts at a time, preferably in cross pattern and do not tighten them fully until all of them are partially screwed in. Then, using your fingers only, Screw in all four thumb nuts until you reach the end of the thread. The installation of the CPU water block is now complete. You can now proceed to the next step. 